Hello friends, welcome to Global Online University. In this series of teaching aptitude paper on solve for Pune University State Examination 2018, this is part 8. You can watch my previous part on my channel and please subscribe before I start <coughs> for the uh, lecture. So friend, the first question was, if a, first question for today's uh, lecture is, if a football is a lighter than tennis ball and basketball is heavier than tennis ball, so friends if you just arrange them according to the uh, their weights you will come across so it says that basketball is heavier than tennis ball but lighter than the handball so uh, first statement a football b sorry <coughs> tennis ball basketball and handball this is correct because uh, if you just uh, uh, write uh, draw on paper and say ki this is more this is less this is less that way it is uh, you will come across this first answer that is football tennis ball basketball and handball so that's the correct answer hope friends you have wrote it correctly <coughs> moving on to the next question of today's lecture is so this was a bit lengthier question so i have to split it into two uh, this thing uh, i suggest you to read it all so question was the following table presents the number of families in the village earning so it was generally about the earning of the village families so there were total 141 families so to answer this you have to divide it see uh, what they have asked in first statement i will go for the first statement approximately 54 percent of the families earn between 10,000 to 20,000 so uh, you just see give to, uh, to for 10,000 to 20,000 there are the 40 plus 36 families so total 76 divided by 141 so that uh, comes approximately to 54 percent so the statement one is correct now <coughs> moving to the next uh, statement there is there are 70 percent families who earn more than 10,000 now if i see 40 plus 36 plus 18 plus 5 so it turns out to be 99 divided by 141 so it comes around 70 point something so this statement also is correct now i will go to the uh, options so option a and option c these uh, two have the first and second as a correct others don't have so others are eliminated so now i'll go to the third statement a family with highest income earns 29 500 so this statement cannot be the true because the final uh, uh, income here given is 30,000 so that is wrong statement so directly I will not uh, calculate the median for the uh, income just uh, C is the right answer for this question oh friends you have made it right now moving on to the next question uh, remember C is the right answer now moving on to the next question now which of the following will complete the series so this was the easiest question according to me uh, so it was like a 17 uh, <coughs> 23 uh, 37 53 so the answer here is 71 uh, it is uh, according to me i don't know what will be the uh, according to your logic so uh, 17 minus 23 is 6 6 into 2 plus you have to add every time you add plus so it will be like 14 16 18 so after 53 it should be plus 18 so it is 71 hope you have answered it correctly friends now moving on to the next question now so this was the the question friends and this was about the <coughs> cases filed under article 498a which you know the, like that article is for the uh, harassment of a married woman uh, about harassment of married woman so the <coughs> data says ki maximum now i'll read the statements uh, the true uh, they have asked us to identify the true statements so maximum increase occurred in jaipur from 2014 to 2015 a, uh, a rough look at data will uh, give us an idea that yeah it's true because you see uh, from <coughs> if you calculate in percentage wise also it is more and number wise also Jaipur has more uh, increase because it has increased to around say 250 to 260 percent of the uh, initial year that is 2013 so yes it has the maximum increase now moving on to the next question next uh, statement that is minimum increase occurred in Hyderabad from 2013 to 14 so yeah that's true because the <coughs> total increase is around just say 5 to uh, sorry it is just 10 to 12 percent so no and in other cases it is more than that 
so the statement 2 also is correct now i'll move to the options now you see option a uh, b c d if you see option a b c d i'm sorry in uh, english part it is not visible you look at the marathi part so option a b c d here you have one and two are correct it is only at uh, a and d case now <coughs> The third uh, statement here is average increase for the period together is lowest in case of Hyderabad. That is, uh, this statement is wrong because average increase is lowest for the Pune. Okay friends, now moving on to the next statement that is minimum increase has occurred in case of Pune <coughs> from 2014 to 15. That is true because there is no increase. That is minimum increase. So statement 4 is absolutely correct. So here statement 1st, 2nd and 4th are correct. For that our option is D. Okay friends. So that was uh, it for uh, this series. I am concluding this series. If any doubt is there, I will uh, solve it in the comment section. Thank you uh, friends for your response. Let me know how. Uh, if you have liked it, please subscribe to my channel and Tell other guys also, uh, your friends to subscribe because this is a new channel and I, everybody like everybody wants to grow, I also wish to grow. If you help me by uh, like adding one or two extra subscribers from your friends or all, th that will help me, that will boost my morale. Thank you friends, uh, hope you have liked this series, thank you, subscribe.